One thing that the left is not is tolerant. This might seem like a broadside attack, and it is. But this whole tolerance thing is just a blind use to push their agenda. We see contradiction in many areas, but one that stands out is this issue of gay rights. The liberals would have everyone believe that were not not for them. Gays would be persecuted both physically and politically. At the same time they show no toleration for groups that do not agree with their agenda. So radical have some on the left become, that they make gay rights into the issue of the day. Nothing must stop this progressive agenda, even if that means putting pro-gay stickers on students' folders and forcing them to carry them around at school as one public school teacher just did. A public school teacher who also happens to be a lesbian has forbidden students to wear crosses as necklaces, and has mandated the placement of pro-LGBT stickers on all students' folders. We'll start with the persecution of students wearing crosses. Liberty Council wrote a letter to the superintendent of schools that reads in part, we write on behalf of parents of children in the classroom of teacher Laura Jane Ridders, a math teacher at Riverview High School, who report that Ms. Ridders has prohibited at least three children from wearing Christian cross necklaces in her classroom, claiming on occasion that they are gang symbols, wrote Liberty Council. That's outrage number one committed by this public school teacher. Next comes the second outrage. The Christian Post reports, moreover, at the beginning of the semester, Ms. Ridges placed LGBT rainbow stickers on students' classroom folders without their consent, which were there one day when the students arrived. One of our clients reports that after she removed the LGBT sticker, Ms. Ridges' behavior toward her changed markedly for the worse. What we have here is a teacher, drawing a salary paid by taxpayers, who is not only denying students their rights and attacking their faith as a gang, but who is openly promoting the gay rights agenda. Not only that, she is forcing students to do likewise by requiring them to carry around folders with pro-LGBT slogans on them. While it is unlikely that Ms. Ridges will be disciplined let alone fired for her behavior given the leftist tilt endemic to much of public school leadership, she certainly needs to be instructed on what toleration for others' beliefs really means. In this case, it means the kids get to wear their crosses, and Ridges keeps her indoctrination and stickers to herself. Please share the story on Facebook and tell us what you think because we want to hear your voice. American Conservative Herald helped contribute to this report. Please help our channel by donating today. The PayPal link is in the comment box down below. It's News Exposed signing off.